Hello everyone and welcome to Geeks for Geeks. The topic for this video is deleting a node in a linked list. Now uh, let us firstly formulate the problem statement. So the problem statement is that given a key that is the data part of the element we have to delete the first occurrence of this key in the linked list. So what we basically need to do is the starting from the head pointer whenever we encounter the first element with the same key we basically delete that element or the node so to delete a node from a linked list we need to do the following steps so it will be basically three step process the first step is to find the previous node of the node to be deleted uh, then we update the next of the previous node to the next of the to the next of the next of the previous node so basically you need to skip uh, one node which is to be deleted and then we free the uh, memory of the node to be deleted so this will make more sense when we go inside the uh, code since every node of the linked list is dynamically allocated using malloc in c we need to call the free or freeing the memory allocated for the node to be deleted so because we are dynamically allocating memory using the malloc when we create a linked list so uh, ideally we should also free the memory when we do not need that memory and that is what we are going to do in this example also so uh, we have a function delete node so in this function uh, we have two arguments first is the pointer pointing to the head ref and then we have the key so this is the key which is to be searched and deleted so first of all what we do is we store the head node inside the temp so this uh, we will be using to traverse the linked list and then we also have a pointer uh, previous which will be keeping the track of the previous node of the node to be deleted so because we'll have to update the pointers of the previous node so we also keep a pointer previous and the temp will act uh, uh, then we'll finally have the uh, pointer to the node to uh, which is to be deleted so if head node itself holds the key to be deleted so we first have a check here that if temp is not equal to null and the key is actually inside the temp so that is the first node itself then we update the head ref to the uh, next of temp and then we just free the temp so in this way we are actually freeing the memory which we allocated using malloc when we were creating the linked list and then we just return so this is a special case wherein you need to uh, delete the uh, first element itself because you found the key in the first element itself if that is not the case then you need to find the key so what we do is we traverse through the linked list so you check if temp should not be equal to null and if uh, temp the data part of the temp is not equal to key you keep traversing so we keep updating the previous as the temp and then we keep moving temp to the next node so we keep doing that till the point we do not reach the end of the linked list or we find a match of the key so if any of these conditions is true so at that time we uh, break out of the loop and then uh, if key was not present so basically you reach the end of the linked list and you find that key was not there so you just return you couldn't delete the element because you didn't find that element otherwise you unlink the uh, node from the linked list so we update the next pointer of the previous as the next of the temp note that temp is actually the node which is to be deleted and then we finally free the memory which was actually uh, blocked by the temp so we also free the memory and in this way we are we have actually deleted the node with the uh, key which was passed to us as an argument that is all for this uh, tutorial thank you very much